Tomorrow, new restrictions will go into effect in Marion County to slow the spread of COVID-19. The changes are once again forcing businesses to quickly adapt. Thanks for joining us tonight at 11 o'clock. I'm Nicole Griffin. Marion County leaders are now requiring bars and entertainment venues to go down to 25% capacity and restaurants to 50% indoors. We talked to local businesses about the impact this will have right before the holidays. We're going to open tomorrow and we're going to see what happens. Um, it, there, there's just no telling. Located right on Monument Circle, Supremacy has been a prime lunch spot for downtown workers for many years. But since the start of the pandemic, the store manager says they went from 90% of sales coming from people buying lunch in the store to now down to 10%. We want employees back in the offices, back in the buildings. Parents that were back at work are now back at home because they have to stay home with their kids. In order to adapt, Supremacy is relying on lunch delivery, meal deals, and frozen delivery. Jason Manship, the owner of Moonshot Games, is continuously adapting as well. On Monday, his mass app location will be reduced down to 25% capacity. We're just fighting through it like everyone else. I think uh, restrictions come and go, uh, rules change, and we just adapt to be as flexible as we can to keep serving our customers. The Mass Ave location is 75% event space, but now Manship is considering shifting it to mainly retail as the holiday shopping season gets underway. He says his biggest concern is the mental health of his customers and not having a safe space for them to come due to the new restrictions. We'd love to see our numbers back up again, but safety is more important than any anything like that. So, um, you know, we, we have made a conscious decision to be open um, instead of just shutting down entirely. Uh, we believe that, you know, we want to see our business survive and we want to see people that support us and that play the games that we work hard to foster. You know, we, we get told all the time, you know, this is the only place I go, right? This is the only place I get out to go because, you know, COVID's locking us down. As some businesses have been forced to close down completely due to the financial impact of the pandemic, the business owners we talked to are hopeful they will make it through and people will eventually come back downtown. I know that our downtown is one of the best downtowns in the country. I know that we are going to get through this. We're going to get through this together. Well, here's a breakdown of some of the changes for Marion County. Again, bars and entertainment venues will be capped at 25% indoor capacity, restaurants at 50%, large gatherings will be capped at 25% capacity, and religious events at 75%. Gyms and fitness studios will be capped at 25% capacity. We have the full list of restrictions at WRTV.com.